Like many people, I bet you have some lanai furniture that you don't use. Furniture that longs to be more, to be something greater, that dreams to contribute to our community and to justice. To be part of exciting art installations and the freedom of expression. To be with sexy anarchist monuments. And most of all, to be with people talking, singing, thinking and planning how to return power to the people. To be part of the longest running urban political encampment in modern Honolulu memory. As you may know, Occupy Honolulu, or as it's more properly known, De-Occupy Honolulu, has suffered repeated raids by the Honolulu Police Department and city crews. The mechanism used is Bill 54, or as it's known now, Ordinance 11-029, which allows seizure of property that has been stored, quote-unquote, on public property for more than 24 hours. The main casualty of these raids has been the furniture for the public forum and the banners so necessary for political message. So turn that forlorn lanai chair into freedom of speech furniture. Let it find some fulfillment so elusive in this corrupt world where corporate rule puts profit above people. Of course your stuff eventually and sooner rather than later will get tagged with a Bill 54 sticker subjecting it to seizure in 24 hours. At that point you can pick up your piece of furniture which will proudly bear the Bill 54 tag, proof of your support for freedom of speech. Or if the thing conjures bad memories you can simply let the city take it away for you. Freedom of speech furniture, the choice is yours.